Hallelujah. We praise your holy name, Jehovah, Father God, mm, Elohim, God of all gods, Alpha and Omega, we come before you. Mm, our great Redeemer, Jehovah Rapha, mm, Jehovah Shalom, we praise your holy name. Cover our heads and we give you great praise, Lord, and we honor and revere you. The Bible says that the fear of the Lord is the beginning of all knowledge, mm, all wisdom. service here once again thank you for being patient with us and spending time with us for this uh, special moment with this with this um, oh Lord thank you Lord mm. Mm, with this program hallelujah this uh, broadcast this, whatever you want to call it but we invite the Holy Spirit to take control come Holy Spirit come and teach us and show us what you have for us this morning hallelujah Mark 9 10 through 30 and they kept that saying with themselves questioning one with another what the rising from the dead should mean and this is a, another conversation that's taking place the conversation that I want to get to is here, 14. And when he came to his disciples, he saw a great multitude about them, and the scribes questing with them. And straightway all the people, when they beheld him, were greatly amazed, and running to him, saluted him. And he answered the scribes, What question ye with them? And one of the multitude answered and said, Master, I have brought unto thee my son, which has a dumb spirit. Mm. And whatsoever and wheresoever he taketh him, he teareth him, and he foameth and gnasheth with his teeth, and pinneth away. And I spake to the disciples that they should cast him out, and they could not. So this man is with his son, and he has enough sense to know that, that it's a dumb spirit that's in his child. Yeah, a dumb spirit. His child is not speaking, yeah, not communicating. And wheresoever he taketh him, he teareth him. So the spirit is te ter tearing him and causing him to foam at the mouth and causing his teeth to gnash. Eh? Yeah. and pin of him to certain places like on the ground and wherever he he's led by the spirit and the man spoke to the disciples and they said they were unable to cast him out yeah they couldn't do it and he answers him and say saith O oh, faithless generation how long shall I be with you how long shall I suffer you bring him unto me this is Jesus now saying this to the crowd to his disciples and they brought him unto him and when he saw him straightway the spirit tear him and he fell on the ground and wallowed and foaming so the spirit is acting up in front of Jesus hmm. and he asked his father how long is it ago since this came unto him and he said, of a child. So Jesus asked how long, and he, the man said, since he was a child. And the man is speaking now. And oftentimes he has cast him into the fire and into the waters to destroy him. So this evil spirit is trying to destroy this, this child. Yeah. By throwing him in the fire and into the water. So yeah, I believe he had many scars on his body. Many wounds. But 
if thou canst do anything, have compassion on us and help us. Yeah, this is the man saying, speaking to Jesus. 23, and Jesus said unto him, If thou canst believe all things are possible to him, that believer. Yeah, if you can't believe, yeah, so just believe, 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 believe. Anything is possible. Yeah, if you believe in the Lord, anything is possible. Yeah, and straightway the father of the child cried out and said with tears, Lord, I believe. Help thou mine unbelief. Yeah. So he said, I believe, but but give me a boost. Yeah. Pu push my belief up. Tie my belief to yours. Do something. And when Jesus saw that the people came running together, he rebuked the foul spirit, saying unto him, Thou dumb and deaf spirit, I charge thee, come out of him, and enter no more into him. And the spirit cried and ran him, saw, and came out of him. And he was as one dead, insomuch that many said he is dead. So after the spirit left the child, the child was laying there as if he was dead. But Jesus took him by the hand and lifted him up, and he arose. The child arose. And when he was come into the house, his disciples asked him privately, Why could not we cast him out? Question mark. <laughs> 29, and Jesus says, and he said unto them, this kind can come forth by nothing but by prayer and fasting. So we have to be in prayer and fasting over the work that God has called us to do, over this type of work, yeah, casting out demons. And, um, and uh, after that, uh, you know, Jesus departed thence and passed through Galilee, and he would not that any man should know it. Yeah. So Jesus was very secretive too. He you know, he didn't want people to know where he was going all the time. But um I just thank you for being with us this morning. Jesus will save a day. He will save a day with me. Jesus will save the day. He will save to the Lord Jesus Christ yeah begin to follow him and he'll make a way for you to give you peace to help you to stop doing some things that you don't like what you you know that you don't like in your life it could be smoking it could be anything but if you just keep communicating to the Lord and ask him to take it from you uh, I guarantee he will honor you honor you and uh, honor your words and take it from you Thank you, Lord.